Hi, my name is Kate Garland and I'm with the University of Maine Cooperative Extension. I'm here to show you how to make seed tape. Seed tape is a lightweight paper with seeds attached at the proper spacing. It's intended to be planted directly into the garden to help gardeners stretch their seed supply and reduce the need for thinning extra seedlings. It's a really fun pre-season activity for all ages. The materials that you'll need are equal parts flour and water, a small bowl, paintbrush or cotton swab, a lightweight paper such as toilet paper or paper towel, seeds of any small seeded crop such as carrots, lettuce, or radish, and a ruler and pen. To make the tape, uh, you want to start by making a paste, uh, mixing the equal parts flour and water. Usually a tablespoon of each should work well. Uh, lay out the paper on a clean, dry table, and then read the seed packet to determine the proper spacing and use a marker to dot where you want the seeds to go. Using a paintbrush or swab, dab the flour or paste, uh, flour and water paste onto each dot, and then while the paste is still wet, carefully place two to three seeds on each dot. Cover with another layer of lightweight paper, and then allow it to dry before carefully storing in a cool, dark, dry location. We typically store our seeds and our seed tape in our refrigerator in a plastic baggie. When you're ready to plant, find a sunny location with good drainage. Loosen up the soil and the planting area to a depth of 6 to 8 inches, removing weeds, rocks, and sticks. You'll want to completely cover the seed tape with a quarter inch of fine soil. Again, you'll want to screen that soil that you top it off with um, from any small stones, hard clumps of soil, sticks and other debris, and then you want to water it thoroughly. It's very important to keep the soil moist as seeds are germinating but not soaking wet. So one way I uh, keep the soil moist is to lay a bo board or a piece of burlap or row cover over the newly planted seed tape for up to a week so that it keeps the area moist. Um, I label my plot with the type of seed um, and the date I planted it. Please share photos and tales of your gardening adventure on our social media pages and be sure to use the hashtag Growing Maine Gardeners. For more gardening tips and to learn more about 4-H, visit our website's extension.umaine.edu forward slash gardening or extension.umaine.edu forward slash 4-H. Have fun!